All right. Well, let's go ahead and head down this new ladder and see what's down there. That was kind of annoying. There was no way to see that guy. Thank God I didn't walk forward. <laughs> I would have walked right into his loving arms. All right. I hope there's a save spot coming up. The problem is there's no fucking map for this area. There's no map for this area, so I don't know where, if and where I could save it all. I don't know where the fuck I am. Where am I? Jachurdy, you missed a ton, dude. You missed almost the entire... I mean, the entirety of the stream. I beat the entire prison. And now I'm in this weird area where I don't know where to go. What the fuck? What the fuck? Where is it? I'm so confused. Where am I? Dude, I need a map for this area. I'm lost. Uh... This sucks. Metal Gear just cheered and said, Can I turn up the brightness? He can't see. I mean, I know the game is dark. I can't see either. I think it's intended to be this way here. Shit. <laughs> Take him in the head. Epic Blaze says this HD version is way darker than the original game. Seriously, it is? But it is like super dark. I can't see anything. Yeah, see, right now, I'm, <laughs> I'm getting a map of the area by walking through it. Eternal Napalm just cheers at hashtag sewer level. I mean, I guess it's kind of a sewer. It's more like a ditch. There's a ladder up. Is this? I think this maybe just loops. Yep. Okay, we got to take the ladder. I hope there's a save point. If there's a boss coming up, I seriously hope there's a save point. Because I have to fucking do all this from scratch if I die to the boss. That's going to be a major pain in the ass. I hope they put a save point somewhere. Ugh. <laughs> since, again, since this is all supposed to be stuff from James' past, I wonder what, like, the these hallways and building... Like, see, there's a wood floor... Like, what is this supposed to be representative of in his past? I don't know. Fuck off. Another dead end. Okay. Another dead end? Seriously? Well, fuck all that. Another way down. Yeah, look. Another way down. So confusing. Game Master used Phoenix down. Yes, what you missed is I finished the prison up, which was very confusing, and now I'm in this new area. I don't even know what's supposed to be representative of. Shout out to Nunya. Oh fuck! Shout out to Nunya Business. Who, fuck? Who fuck? 
has resubscribed for the third month in a row. This guy's in a room by himself walking in a fucking circle. Alright, here's a new ladder, right? Yep, okay. Cheap hit I couldn't fucking see. There. Fuck. Another ladder. Good God. What a labyrinth. This is one hell of a fucking labyrinth right now. Ladder there. <clears throat> Don't fucking spin on someone else, piece of shit. <laughs> past pyramid head somehow but I don't know how let's see what's up here <clears throat> oh well then this is good this is very good I wonder what's past pyramid head though should I bother trying to get past them or it would not be worth it All right, here's what I'm going to do. By the way, shout out to Paul Jedi who just resold for the seventh month in a row. Thank you, Paul Jedi, for the seven months of support. I just saved the game. I'm going to head down and try to get past Pyramid Head and see what's down there and see if it's worth it. If it's not, I'm just going to come back up here and go through the door. But I want to see if I can get past Pyramid Head and if there's something worth it. I the feeling in my original playthrough, I probably didn't do this. Uh, so left. <laughs> you know, if I could just walk forward straight, this would be great. I see another ladder. So it all just loops. Where does this other ladder go? It's a new area. Is it a dead end? All it is is two handgun bullets. So in reality, the fact that I, I lose health, yeah. The fact that I lose health getting stabbed by Pyramid Head there, that ain't worth it. That is not worth it. All right. How do I get out of here? There's no way to, like, go to the menu, is there? Like, there's no way to quit the game, right? Without dying? I guess if I kill myself, I guess I'll kill myself. I'll go kill myself so that I can reload... And not have to come after those handgun bullets. It's a complete waste of time. Where's Pyramid Head? I want to get Pyramid Head to kill. I want to see what happens if he'll like, impale me. There he is. Get me. Yeah, kill me. 
Do it. Oh, that wasn't impressive at all. That was lame. That was a lame ass kill. That was so lame. I was expecting like he's gonna impale you and have you know blood and guts squirting. No, he just like a little a little doink. He doinks you with the spear. Ah, <laughs> hey, gotcha. Doink. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're just gonna go through the fucking door. Forget all that shit. Yeah, Game Master says, but there's so much to live for. Yeah, but now if I have to waste my health to get a couple bullets. Oh, no. I know what's coming up. This is it, isn't it? Abstract Daddy Boss. And this is one of the things I remember so much from this game. Oh, my God. It's, it is. Oh, my God. This is fucked up, dude. This is seriously the most fucked up thing in this game right here. That's disgusting. And once you find out what this is, it's even fucking worse. That was not fair. This is totally unfair. How is it fair that the boss fight starts and the boss is already in your face attacking you? You don't even have a chance to move. That's not fair at all. It's fucking stupid. That's really stupid. At least now I know to equip the right weapon and everything, but that is dumb as hell. Okay. And yes, I am going to use the rifle because it's a boss. Abstract daddy. So I guess I'll just run to the corner, do one or two bullets, run around the corner, do one or two bullets, and just keep doing that pattern if I can. Daddy. No. I couldn't move! Dude, you saw that? It was delayed! What the fuck? Fucking controls suck. Not the controls that load loading suck. Like I shouldn't have got hit. The problem is he's fucking fast. Look how fast he is. I can't do anything. If I take a shot, I get stuck. There's no way to fire and not get hit after because he's too fast. See? There's no way to shoot him and not get hit afterward. And now I'm gonna die. This is bullshit. Well, fuck. I'm gonna try. I'll try the shotgun. See if that's faster. I still can't. I can't get a single shot off without getting hit afterward. It's completely unfair. Dude, I can't, I, I don't think I can kill this boss. How are you supposed to kill a boss that always gets a hit when you hit him? I, this is so stupid. This is so fucking stupid. Why, again, hard difficulty makes the game unplayable, pretty much. How am I supposed to kill a boss for every shot I take, he's gonna run because he's fast and he grabs me and does 50% damage? It's complete bullshit. What? I wanna do this. Siesta John Jugo says that if you get grabbed, if you, you flick the left stick square and X, he'll, he'll get off faster. Is that true? Oh, I can read the newspaper. It's something that looks like blood and is partially ineligible. 
The Bruf of a man later identified as Thomas Oro Brut Lumberjack, age of 39, was discovered on the Bruvlu Line Brook. The probable cause of death. Multiple stab wounds to the front of the neck and to the left side of the torso by a sharp-edged weapon. The estimated time of death was somewhere between 11 p.m. and 12.30 midnight. Due to signs of struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon, police are considering the homicide and have opened a murder investigation. Furthermore, given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and Mr. Orobr had a history of drunkenness and violence, the police uh, suspect that the motive was not robbery but, and it was a crime of passion. So I think what they're saying is Angela killed her dad. Oh my god, man. I want to fucking go through the door. They won't let me through the door. Either it goes to the save or it fucking goes to the loose paper. I can't go through the door. Jesus Christ. There's no way to hit him and not get hit afterward. This is a joke. This is a bad joke. This is a terrible joke. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Cause he's not this fast on the normal difficulty. On normal difficulty, he's slow, so you can shoot and dodge and shoot and dodge. You can't do anything. You literally can't avoid him. He hates you no matter what. What the fuck? I don't know what to do here. How the fuck did I beat him? If he was this speed on normal, how the fuck did I beat him? Plus, this is hard, so it's probably going to take like 20 shots to kill him. I don't have a chance to fire! There's no chance to fire the weapon! It doesn't slow him down! Oh my god! I'm gonna get grabbed here. I was glitched, I couldn't move. Alright, so now that I'm mashing, it's working. When I mash, I get out of it way quicker. See that? I got stuck on her. Yeah, and I take way less damage. Oh shit, okay, I gotta mash. Get the fuck out of here. Use this. No. Because that's the knife that killed him. That's the knife I got earlier. That's the knife that killed him. Alright, so what do I do is shoot him twice? Yeah, this is what you do. Okay, I know what to do. That was bullshit. You need to get far enough away to shoot him twice in a row, then he gets stunned. Yeah. Then you can run behind him. I couldn't move. I couldn't do it. It wouldn't let me get past this stupid bitch. This is horse shit. I can't. Oh my god.
I got him. Got him. I wasted a ton of healing, though. Childhood trauma. It's such a fucked up boss when you know what it is. Are you okay? <laughs> Here's the TV. Angela, relax. Don't order me around. <laughs> I'm not trying to order you. So what do you want then? Oh, I see. You're trying to be nice to me, right? I know what you're up to. It's always the same. You're only after one thing. No. Yeah, we know what it is. <laughs> you don't have to lie. Go ahead and say it. Or you could just force me. Beat me up like he always did. You only care about yourself anyway. You disgusting pig. Angela. Don't touch me! You make me sick. It's messed up. Really fucked up. The thing is, she's so messed up in the head you can't blame her. With the shit she's been through. You said your wife Mary was dead. Right? Right. Yes. She was ill. Liar! I know about you. That uh, uh. You don't want her around anymore. You probably found someone else. Well, what ungrateful bitch! You saved her life. That's ridiculous. From her childhood trauma, and then she fucking it, insults you. <laughs> Although it's funny now because now they're insinuating that he did kill his wife, right? I wonder if you can ever use the knife on anything. I don't know. It just seems like a, a placeholder item. You can't really use it on anything useful. Well, the good news is, I had so much rifle ammo that I found in the city, right? That I did insane damage there. It's not so bad. I mean, it sucks that I used two ampoules, but outside of that, it actually wasn't so bad of a fight. Alright. Get out of here. I guess I should save again. Fuck, he puts face, face first to the wall. What a genius. Okay, save up. Alright. October just resubbed for the 10 month in a row. He says 10 months of sub hype. Good job killing daddy. Yeah. It's just it's a messed up part of the game. I mean, when you are like, oh god, that's what it is. That's her dad. That's fucked up, man. Really fucked up. What the fuck? It's just a puzzle, right? Is this a puzzle? Hold on. This man was hung for the crime of swindling just as a revenge had been served. Murder. Thievery. Kidnapping. Arson. Counterfeiting. Could this be the crimes that they're all in here for? Like, he's probably in here for the murder of his wife, right? I think that uh, Angela's in here for murder. Then again, I think they're all in here for murder, right? Eddie, too. We already found out Eddie is fucking nuts. 
he's probably in here for murder too. Huh. Dead men, dead men, swinging in a tree. How many dead men do you see? Tongue turn blue and face go on gray. Watch them as they twist and sway. The first one killed the butcher man, then cooked him in a frying pan, served them to his hungry guests, and gave them seconds on request. The next one with his smile and sweet stole poor children off the streets. That's kidnapping. The men who dressed on savory, he sold them into slavery. Damn. Breaking into a home at night, the thief had a nasty fright. Filled his foolish head with ale, Woke in the morn in the county jail. The artist, with his daunting skills, tried his hand at painting Bill. That's counterfeit. But caught in rain, he was undone, and then ink he used did start to run. So it was murder, kidnapping, thievery, uh, and, and counterfeiting. With promises of great return, taking gold he did not earn, bundled it up out of sight, quietly slipped off into the night. That's swindling. So that's five, is swindling. Three houses into ash burned. The sheriff, with no place to turn, did try spry, spy a, a stranger to his town, locked him up, and beat him down. It's arson. Dead man, dead man, swinging in a tree. How many do you see? Blah, blah, blah. So maybe I gotta touch the nooses in order. So I gotta go. So it's murder. Let's see here. I have to do it in order. So murder, kidnapping, thievery. Counterfeiting, swindling, arson. Let's go look at the order. Shit. Stuck in a fucking corner. Nope. Okay. So, first would be murder. Okay. So, middle, bottom... Next is kidnapping. Nope. This one. Middle bottom, upper right. The next was thievery. Okay. So, middle bottom, upper right. Lower right. Then it was counterfeiting. Which is upper left. So middle bottom, upper right, lower right, upper left, lower left, middle top. So let's do an, or an order. One, two, three, four. So there'll be five, three, six. No. Five three six two. No. Five three six one. Yeah. Five three six one four two. Five three six one four two. Five three six one four two. Okay. All right. Five, right here. Three. <laughs> oh yeah. Shout out to Wowee. Wowee, just subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the sub. Six. One.
four. Just a memory puzzle. All right, and now two. Which is arson, the last one. That should be it. That's it? I guess that's it? I guess that's it. Fred Flintstone Cheers said, these are counterfeit bits. Now you're in possession of them. Doesn't mean anything. <laughs> but thank you for the cheer. Archangel Cheers said, hey, Phil, drop by to say what's up. What's up, man? What the fuck? Huh? Huh? What? Where'd that... What the fuck? It just loops you back to the same room? Key of the Persecuted. The paper was covering the corpse's face lying here. Key left by a prisoner who was wrongly executed. That's interesting. I wonder what I use it on. Siesta... Jan Jugo says the actual the actual solution was just to pull the arsonist, but because I pulled the arsonist last, I got the puzzle right anyway. What the hell? Seriously? So it was just my luck? Well, that's dumb. Why wasn't I just supposed to pull all of them? In, in order. That's weird. What the fuck? Aha. Uh -huh. Can't turn it unless you remove the handcuffs, I see. There you go. Yeah, apparently I was supposed to pull the rule for the innocent one. How the hell would I tell who was innocent? How could I tell that? <laughs> I had no idea. Get the fuck out of here. It is kind of refreshing to honestly to not have to keep pressing stop on my recording. That I can just concentrate on the game, you know? Like, I don't have to keep looking at the time and how long I'm recording and stuff. It's pretty good. Yeah, I used to do that. It's locked. No shit. I used to do that when, uh, when I was doing longer videos like two or three years ago. Oh, I got nothing to use on that. Okay, we're we getting out of here or what? Aha! Maria? Maria? Maria, no. Look at they're not showing her face, look. What happened to you? The room is number 208, by the way. You see that? 208, it says on the door. So he finally gets over there, and now she's dead. Brutally murdered. Yeah. Ew. She had a little something on her face. We give her a handkerchief. <laughs> So 
maybe now he's starting to remember in his head he's starting to remember he actually did kill his wife or something Flashlight went out. <laughs> That's a troll move. It's a fucking troll move. Ow. Face first to a ladder. <laughs> la la la. We came out at the other end, look. How's their look at his graves? So weird. A fucking graveyard inside the a building. Grab some items. Nice shotgun shells. I have like 140 shotgun shells now or something insane. figured out there's probably another puzzle here. Okay. Yes, I am aware BK201 tack, I probably have to examine the graves. Probably a good idea. Is that Ampool? Nice. My name is from the Tombstone, James Sunderland. Angela Orozco. Eddie Dombrowski, it's all three of them. And there's their graves. Two scratched up to read. Walter Sullivan. Miriam K, traitor. So someone was a traitor to the people who lived here. Two scratched up to read. up to read. I guess that's it. Now I, do I go down to a grave? It's this one. Two scratch up to read. Go down into your own grave, of course. Why not? <laughs> he lands in a fucking hallway. Of course he does. Another staircase going down, huh? At this point, he's like in the in the center of the Earth. He's gone down so far. He's in the center of planet Earth. There's molten lava everywhere. <laughs> or he's just in Silent Hill, and this game is pretty fucked up. Oh, nice! Got a nice red tinge to everything now. My favorite. Loading. We got a cutscene. Maybe an FMV. Yup. Oh boy, look at this. Eddie. Crazy Eddie. Eddie? What are you doing? What does it look like? You always busted my balls. You fat, disgusting piece of shit. You make me sick. Fat ass, you're nothing but a waste of skin. You're so ugly, even your mama don't love you. Wow. It's basically all those bullies. Well, Kill those bullies. Right. Maybe I am nothing but a fat, disgusting piece of shit. But you know what? It doesn't matter if you're smart, dumb, ugly, pretty. It's all the same once you're dead. <laughs> yes, it is. The and ultimate equalizer. From now on, if anyone makes fun of me, I'll kill him. Just like that. Sounds great. Eddie, have you gone nuts? I knew it. You too. You're just like him, James. Hey, I didn't mean anything. Don't bother. I understand. 
You've been laughing at me all along, haven't you? Ever since we first met. I'll kill you, James. Oh, great. Guess I gotta kill him. I got shot. What the fuck? This fuck is shooting me like crazy. Sucks. The gun's too slow. Well, I survived it, but I used my ampoules. What a stupid fight. Fucking fat fuck Eddie Spaghetti. <laughs> Sid's just shooting you with a fucking handgun like an asshole. Alright, well. Guess we're done there. So shout out to Octobo who did a 50 bit cheer and said pumped up kicks. I think he's referencing Eddie's Eddie's shoes. Oh look at this. And shout out to Austin who did a 100 bit cheer. He says Walter Sullivan died and he haunts the apartment complex. Which you live in in Silent Hill 4. But you're hated, <clears throat> picked on, spit on, just because of the way you look. After you've been laughed at your whole friggin' life. That's why I ran away after I killed the dog. Ran huh. away like a scared little girl. Yeah, I killed that dog. It was fun. It was fun. I tried to chew its own guts up. Finally died all curled up in a ball. Then he came after me. I shot him too, right in the leg. He cried more than the dog. <laughs> wow. Shout out to Swaz Bebop who subscribed to the channel. Thank you for the sub. He's gonna have a hard time playing football on what's left of that knee. You think it's okay to kill people? You need help, Eddie. Don't get a holy on me, James. This town called you too. You and me are the same. We're not like other people. Don't you know that? Let's party! I can't see him because the camera sucks. Wow, I tried to fucking use it. It didn't work. Now he reloaded. Well, I have only two healing items left. I couldn't move. I was stuck in the corner. He shot the meat. I missed somehow. Even though I was aiming straight for him, it missed. This sucks. I can't move. I'm stuck on the meat. He shot me even though I was running full speed.
I shot the meat. Doesn't even make sense. I shot meat. And I can't heal. This fucking fucking this fucking ridiculous, dude. I'm gonna have to redo a ton of shit because there was no fucking save point anywhere. I'm gonna have to redo all that stuff. He killed me with a punch! I'm shooting him point blank in his face with a fucking hunting rifle. He kills me with a wimpy punch. Oh my god, this fucking sucks. This is ridiculous on hard difficulty, dude. How many fucking bullets do I have to put in them? Hunting rifle bullets. What the hell? No, I know there was a save in the graveyard, but I still have to do the whole first part of the fucking fight over now. Which is trash. Maybe I could beat, beat him the whole first part with just the fucking handgun. Let's see if I can beat him with just a handgun and not waste any ammo with anything else. Ugh. I can't pull my gun! Oh! Uh, <laughs> who would let me pull a gun? This is insanely stupid. Thirty bullets? At least thirty bullets? He didn't fucking die? What on earth? Hard difficulty. Hard difficulty. Thirty fucking bullets. He doesn't die. Oh my god. Oh, so Yola Dopper cheer. Thank you for the cheer, Yola Dopper. It's totally up to you. It's your decision, your business, what you do on my streams to support. So thank you for any support you lend. There you go. So the handgun's worthless. We know that. I wonder if I could, do you think I could hit him with melee? Let me see something. Okay, I'm trying to see what's the fastest weapon I have. They're about equal. In fact, this one, if you just keep doing it, look, it's actually a little faster. The green knife is too slow, I think, right? I'll probably never even hit him with it. It's too slow. Yeah. All right, I'll try. I'll try various things. We'll try the plank. If that doesn't work, I'll try the pipe. If that doesn't work, I'll try the fucking 
sword. Because I just don't want to waste tons of ammo on this asshole. I want to find a way to beat him without wasting, like, a lot of ammo and items so I can get to the second phase. Patriarchy, no. The thrust with the pipe is just tapping. When you hold it is when he does the two-hand smash. It's the opposite of what you're suggesting. didn't work. This doesn't work. I'm pressing the button. Nothing's happening. Alright, this might work. He's stuck in place. He can't get out. I trapped him in the corner. Yeah, it worked! I trapped him in the corner. So I only used one healing item. That's not bad. That's not so bad. You trap him in the fucking corner. Bopped him on the head like a fucking... <laughs> like a rubber ball. Bouncy, bouncy off the ball. <laughs> Right, so I guess I gotta use the hunting rifle in this next part, and I just gotta be like, stay away, fire, run. Stay away, fire, run. I don't know what else to do. The major problem with the boss fighting is, Eddie, you can't see what you're doing. Because the fucking camera doesn't fucking aim straight, so you can never see where he is to see if you're aiming at him or you're aiming at a piece of fucking meat. It's so stupid. He auto-aims for pieces of meat instead of the enemy in front of him trying to kill him. Otaku Skull Gaming just cheered and said, you're pretty cool. I watch you on YouTube a lot. That I come by and give you Twitch a cheer. Thank you very much. I appreciate that because I need your support right now as much as possible, so thank you. Normal Shaggy Rogers cheer said there was nothing I could do. I got stuck in a corner. Alright. What? I'm behind the meat. He still hit me. He's shooting me through the meat. Wow. This is fucking horse shit. Eternal Napalm Trudy said boss design really has evolved in 17 years, hasn't it? I mean, it's, it's not even like boss fights in this game aren't even real bosses. They're just like really messed up fucking situations where you have to do combat that suck. Look at that! He's standing in front of me. I can't hit him. It doesn't even make sense. He's standing directly in front of me. I can't shoot the fucker. I was, look, I'm trying to heal. Yeah, this fucking sucks. It's really stupid, and especially on hard difficulty, it makes it almost impossible. Because he has, he's a bullet sponge. Yes, I'm gonna waste all my fucking rifle ammo on this idiot. Ugh, it's so dumb. Walking nonsense.
I'm holding the button, it's not attacking. Look! I can't attack, it won't attack. Wow, we trade hits and I die. This sucks. <laughs> this fucking sucks. I'm kidding, you just shoot me anyway. Lame, so lame. Hard difficulty. Yeah, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> sure it is. Fun. Captain the Soul says, remember the five D's of dodgeball. Yes. Awesome mate cheered 100 bits. It says, this game reminds me of his childhood family trip to Maine. I'm not quite sure what that means. <laughs> uh. Actually, maybe I don't want to know what that means. I can't hit him once. I, the game would not let me hit him once. Not once. Every time I swung, it was massively delayed. He would swing too late. He'd be running in circles. This is insane. This is so bad. It's so badly made, dude. I mean, come on. Really? Again, on normal, maybe it's different, but on fucking regular, this is stupid. Or uh, on hard, this is stupid as fuck. It's so dumb. Normal Shaggy Rogers gave me a cheer, and he said, Street Fighter voice says, perfect. Yes, perfect. Uh, thank you to jo John Snooze, who just subscribed to the channel. John Snooze. I actually wonder if uh, well, how we're doing here with sub count. We've gone up to 422. Thank you, everybody. 422 subs. Thank you, everyone, for, again, for your support on the stream. Uh, you know, appreciate anything you lend because right now you know the situation I'm in with YouTube basically making no money. So the only only income I got is right now what uh you know what you guys are contributing, and of course people who are being very generous. On things like Patreon and the like, so thank you guys, I appreciate that. And I hope to have I hope to have updates for you regarding the DSP gaming situation this week, but I don't know if I will. It may just be sitting around forever and getting a no. See, I'm fooled. To be three dollars, said I think that hard difficulty is very entertaining. <laughs> well, good for you. Good for you. I'm sidestepping, he still hits me. This is a fucking waste of my time. Coral guy sure said that I tried the music box yet. I wish I had a music box. This is so stupid. I actually did the best of the first try. Try, trying other methods don't work. Like, it's just fucking garbage. It doesn't work. I'm just gonna fucking blow them away. I had enough. The Paradox Tree said this game is fun. Now, it was fun the first time I played. As long as the game is, it was a lot more fun the first time I played because normal difficulty is, is a hell of a lot more fair than this stupid shit. This is just ridiculously dumb. It really is.
hard or difficult. Yeah, great. Captain of the Soul says, this is great. Okay, I'm glad you're having fun. I'm glad someone here is having fun. Because I'll tell you, this is not fun to play on hard difficulty. It's just not. It's just fucking stupid. Can't do anything, I was stuck in the animation. Can't, can't do anything about it. I just had to fucking up close spam the fuck out of him. Nothing you could do, no strategy involved there. Just blow them away with shotgun shells because it's fucking stupid as hell. Maybe that's the key. Get him to waste all his bullets and then when he's trying to reload, just keep unloading into him because he don't have a chance to reload. Maybe that's what you're supposed to do. Behind me, I got out of the way. Where the fuck is he? Look, where is he? I shot over his shoulder. The controls are so bad. Heal, heal! Can't heal. Oh my god. It's such a joke. Why isn't it reloading? He never reloaded! I've been hitting him nonstop with rifle bullets. Rifle bullets. He beats me with handgun bullets from max range. This is so stupid. What a dumb fucking fight and what a dumb fucking thing on hard, dude. He would be dead if it was normal. See how many fucking bullets I put in him? What the fuck? This is near impossible. Stupid. So fear you can't run away. The controls are so bad. It's old school tank controls. There's no way to do anything on reaction. When he lifts his gun, you can't get out of the way. Even if you start running, he still shoots you. It's, it's, there's no way to avoid it. The controls are so old and just fucking outdated. But that's what made this game tough. If you had good controls, the game would actually be easy. I 
can't fire. I can't fire the gun. The whole time I'm trying to fire, it won't let me. Now I can't heal. Look, it's so fucked up. The controls are so delayed, you can't fire the fucking weapon of the idiot who's standing in front of you. What? Whoa, waste of time, dude. Coral guy says this guy should be dead by lead poisoning by now. This is just a fucking joke. So bad. <sighs> Patriarch, I have no idea what the if there's a, another control option, but it's not gonna matter. The problem is, look, it takes so long to draw your weapon before you can fire, then to drop the weapon so that you can move effectively move again. That's the problem here, and you can't strafe or move while aiming. <laughs> Very frustrating. I just started. See, I can't strafe. I'm trying to strafe. I'm trying to strafe. It doesn't work at all. The strafe is completely worthless. The strafe is completely worthless. He fucking tracks where you are and shoots you anyway. Unbelievable. Yes, I am. I'm using a regular PS3 controller. while holding the shotgun. Look at that. Right, maybe I'll try that. F try firing while strafing. I guarantee you he'll still hit me. He's still gonna shoot me. Suffering, this is a boss. Oh my god. Suffering, says, save your ammo until you get to a boss. What do you think this is? Did you just go around shooting normal people this whole game? <laughs> Can't do anything after you fire. There's not enough recovery time, or there's too much recovery time to strafe after. He still gets a shot off no matter what. It's just complete trash. Look, I'm running full speed around him. He still hits me with the gun. This fucking sucks. People are screaming to try to use the knife. Coral Guy cheered. He says, We all know Eddie, that fat pizza loving dog murderer, is also a trained marksman with lethal precision. That's all about snapping necks and cashing checks. <laughs> oh my god. Fine, I'll try the knife. I'll die even faster. <clears throat> oh, forget this. How am I going to kill him with this? I can't even walk. Look. I can't even move holding this. So that's a no-go. I'll never even get to swing it near him. He'll fucking run around me in circles and hit me, shoot me, and interrupt me. <clears throat> I 
I'd love to finish this. I only have 10 minutes left on stream. I would love to finish this today, but it looks like I'm not going to. It looks like it's just going to take hours until I randomly get lucky. like a bitch he ran like a bitch after that he's like oh fuck You're like, I'm getting the fuck out of here dude dude that was pretty funny he ran like a bitch oh my god I'm stuck. I was stuck on the meat. Nothing I can do. I can't move. He's way too fast in this room to hit him with it. It's just impossible. too fast. I can't hit him with it. He won't stand still. Yeah, I can't hit him. There's no way. If I can get him stuck in a small area, maybe, but I can't. There's no way to do it. that where is it where the fuck is he swinging he's swinging at the corner wow he walked into it like an idiot I think he able to do this again he walks over here healing items we're right through them He's about to die. Maybe. Maybe that's why he's hiding. I don't know. I think he may be hiding because he has no health left. I don't know.
I got him! I used all my healing items, but I got him. All my healing items, I hit him up four times with the fucking knife. Oh Eddie? my god. Eddie? I have no healing. I, I killed a, a human being. So the only reason I won is because he was stupid as fuck and walked into the knife repeatedly. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, this is so stupid. Ugh. Yeah, what an epic boss fight. Sure it was, Eternal. <laughs> Did you really die three years ago? Is that it? I get I get the gun now, right? Don't I get the magnum from him? No? You can't get the magnum from him? What the fuck? Really? I guess not. Shout out to Orcs or Dorks who did a 100-bit cheer. He said, nice tries, Phil. Sorry about the YouTube situation. Once on Hammer did a 500-bit cheer, which incidentally makes you the top cheer for the day, but I'm done with the stream for today. But thank you for the support. And he says, 86 hits, Pyramid Head saves the day, and Eternal Napalm did a 100-bit cheer. Okay. Fear the Worm says he's wearing shorts with socks. He deserved to die. <laughs> wow, that's kind of harsh. Where the fuck am- oh my god, where the fuck am I? Dude, this really sucks. I have no fucking health, and I have no idea where I am, and I need to save the game. Oh, good. Well, thank goodness. I think we're near the waterfront. If I remember, near the waterfront is where the hotel is, and that's the final area of the game, I think, right? I think we're headed to the waterfront hotel. Absolute Psycho says this labyrinth probably represented James' subconscious. At this point, he's lost and confused. He doesn't realize the truth yet. Later, it becomes intertwined with Angela and Eddie's subconscious and other people with the darkness in their hearts. There's a light. That's where you're supposed to go. What's the other way? Yeah, remember in the I remember if there was no fog in the last in uh, the HD version that I played six years ago. It's all blocked. Puppet Doc says, yes, this next area is the last area, so maybe one more stream, I'll be done with the game. Probably. Probably finish it later this week. The boat! I think you sail across, right? You sail your, your road to that light, and that's where the hotel is? I think so. Octola, I saved! I just saved the game. Haha. <laughs> Octola thought that I missed the save point. No, I saved. Alright, so, next time I play... I guess it'll be the final session, right? All right.